hey, this is my QR code creator little app. So if you give it a URL, it will create a QR code. But but more importantly, is it will give you it in different um, color schemes and different stylings because sometimes you want to match the color of a, a poster or a website or something. Um, so, so this is just like a simple Flask app that I have running locally. You can see here in my VS Code that, yeah, I just started it up. But I want to get this into the cloud so that I can share it with others. And to do that, I'm going to use Cloud Code and I'm going to use Pulumi MCP. So here's my Cloud Code window. Right? And if you go to MCP, you can see that I have installed this um, Pulumi MCP server. I can go in, I can view the tools Right, and you can see it has a number of them, but this one uh, is the one that's most important to me, right? Because it is going to help me deploy an application to AWS. And uh, it does it in a great way because it knows a lot of the best practices. It will offer some suggested approaches and it will make sure that you're doing things correctly. So to use that, first thing I did was just add this MCP server into my Claude code here somewhere. Here it is. MCP servers, Pulumi. That was pretty simple. And now uh, I just open it up in my folder here and say, uh, let's deploy this to AWS. Let's see what it does. You can find uh, Pulumi MCP server here on GitHub. And yeah, it's quite easy to install. And here's a list of available commands, for instance, including this one that I just briefly mentioned. So here we have some suggested approaches. Let's bring this back up. Um, AWS ECS Fargate, uh, we can do Lambda, uh, or we can do AWS App Runner or traditional. Okay, so this is one of the great things with the plugin is it's analyzed my solution and suggested some ways. Uh, App Runner, I think is, is a pretty neat solution, but I'm just going to go with the uh, ECS Fargate because that's kind of a standard safe way that I'm used to doing this. And now what Cloud Code is going to do is build out the infrastructure as code to set this up and then do a deploy using Pulumi MCP. All right, so a cloud code says we're done. Uh, your QR code creator is here. 44 resources created, uh, VPC, load balancer, Fargate, security groups, all those best practices in place. Plus, you know, here's our CloudWatch dashboard and we have our infrastructure as code um, in this infrastructure folder. So if we wanted to make changes in the future, it's easy to go in um, change the region, change the sizing, uh, change everything and version it and understand it. And we have a nice readme here. But uh, most importantly, let's test it out. There we go. It's up. It's, wait, let's try it. It's up. It's working. And uh, we have our QR code generator that we can share with others. Um, but what's really powerful is because we're using this Plumi MCP server, we didn't just get a running service. I now have all that infrastructure as code that I can reuse, that I can version, uh, that I can manage over time. But I have all that without needing to be an expert in cloud infrastructure. It makes it easy to get going. I can just use cloud code and an MCP server and I'm off.